Jean Persani with Beauty and the Stamper, and look who's back. Hi! You guys, you tell me that you love her, so I had to bring her again. Today we're doing um, crafting pumpkins. You guys, today is probably the last day we're going to do Halloween. Yeah. So we're going to be crafting all day. Sorry if you get sick and tired of all the videos, but we need to do the Halloween so we can move on to the fun stuff. Thanksgiving, Christmas, and just general DIYs. But we have so much like... Our table looks a lot better though. Yeah, it does. It does. So what we're going to do is we're going to paint pumpkins. And she came up with a really pretty idea. Go ahead, tell them what it so, is. So we got, we, we wiped out Dollar Tree again. Yes. Because <laughs> we're not going to, we're going to use these for Christmas as well. Some more that we bought. I'm going to end up painting mine completely. Um because I feel like this is too too bright of an orange for, for my craft project. So I'm gonna go with like a, paint the whole thing like a lighter, creamier kind of orange per oh, se. Oh, show them the colors. I'm, using, I'm gonna use the Arteza. Um, and I haven't decided which color I'm gonna use yet, so there you go. Okay, well, we've I have got I can't reach that far. Mars <laughs> orange, or Naples yellow, or mix them both together. I think I'm gonna put them together, <laughs> realistically. So I'm gonna paint my whole pumpkin and then I'm just gonna glue leaves and just make an edge around it. Um, so it could be Halloween, you could use it for fall also. So it's gonna be one of those dual purpose ones, which I like. Yeah. I just noticed I have like a streak <laughs> of like this really light color right here. I kind of look like um, Frankenstein's bride. I just noticed it right now. I'm like, oh my gosh. Anyways, I too am <laughs> gonna <you>. be. <laughs> I'm going to be using a pumpkin as well, but I'm also going to be using this um, bow here. And then th these two things were from the Dollar Tree. And then this guy was from the 99 cent store. And I bought this. It's a witch's hat, but I did not buy it for a witch's hat. I bought it for Christmas. And so this is a Halloween item, but also a Christmas item because I'm going to be doing the Nightmare Before Christmas. I'm going to be making... Uh, Jack Skellington so we'll put these aside and we're just gonna I think we should just paint our stuff of course I'm just gonna be using the white um, because he is white so fair enough, fair enough. I, I'm gonna hold this guy here because we're gonna be taking him off afterwards so I'm just gonna put the white paint and we're gonna get painting um, mine is gonna be just white so I will. Easy peasy. Yeah. Um, okay. I need one of what those. What do you need? One of these? Yes. There we go. Well, I'm open it. This is the one that you got for like eight. There's like eight of them in here. What yeah. size do you want? Pick a size. Uh, I'll use this the big little, one? One, little one. Okay. Okay. So I like to use these. Um, and... Uh, I don't know. I, I have paintbrushes too, but I think I'm going to use the paintbrushes for more of a, um, detail, not detail so much as <laughs> not detail so much as like the eyes and the mouth, <laughs> the little stuff, not the detail though, just the little stuff. Oh gosh. All right. Okay, thank you. I know. So I'm going to start painting up here because I want it to dry. And um, when I take that out, hopefully it'll be dry by then. You just cut it off? Cut what off? The little stem. No, you just pull it out. It's Oh, like, it's a piece all in itself? Yeah, oh, no? it's kind of like stuck on there. Um, I think with a toothpick or something. I kind of want to pull it out just to see now. Right? <laughs> so I'm just gonna put this here. Ah, I already got ink all over me. So the white's gonna be easy. And I'm not gonna fast forward any of this just because we enjoy having fun crafting and we want to just kind of share it with you. I also thought about doing it live, but um But that's the great thing about technology, is if you want to, you can fast forward yourself. Right? <laughs> So with mine, I actually put both colors together, and I really like it. And I'm not like mixing it so it's all perfectly 
blended so you see like random streaks of one color more than the other oh yeah which is fine because who are we kidding some pumpkins are ugly <laughs> but those are the ones i always pick i always pick the ones with bumps and lumps and me and my kids we always name our pumpkins oh do you yeah <laughs> There's usually like a Steve in there, <laughs> but I'll always get a like a bummy one that has like all the, the one that nobody ever wants. I'm all about that one. I always name it Bumba Lump. Oh. Random fact. <laughs> okay, so the reason we're painting these with um, with paint, uh, acrylic paint, is that it actually um, what's the word I'm looking for? If you do it with like a spray paint, it bubbles up. Like, I don't know, there's something in the spray paint that makes it bubble up. So if you want to um, see that, stick around because we're going to be moving on to a different craft later this week. And we want it to bubble up. What so, are we making? What? So what are we making? I can't tell you. Oh, okay. Well, I'll be here for that one so I can see. I want to see. <laughs> it's going to be really cool. So for some reason, this is not going well. Let me see here. I don't know what, what's going on here. I'm going to put... Just add the paint onto it. Yeah. And we're just going to put it right around. Oh, there we go. Yeah, see, mine? I like that color. I do. It's more of like a... But yours is not going like mine is. For some reason, mine is not holding very well. But yours is doing well. Mm -hmm. I may actually have to spray paint it. And that's okay, because like I said, I don't know if there's something in my pumpkin. Are they coated with anything? I don't know. I don't either. But, I mean, yours isn't doing it, and I haven't had this problem with any of my other ones. We're going to say it's user error. No, we're going to say it's pumpkin error. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's totally pumpkin error. I am very easy to cop up to user error, because I do user error all the time. But this is not coming out well. So, we'll see. See, look, the bottom is fine. I think it is, I don't think, I think it was coated with something. Maybe. I'm not gonna bother painting the bottom of mine because what's the point? Why waste the paint on something nobody's gonna see? And then you gotta flip it upside down and dry and that's just more time. I don't, yeah. I don't have time for that. Right? <laughs> we, got, we got more crafts to make. I don't have time for that. <laughs> <laughs> I think, I don't know what's going on with mine. I mean, it's nice and white, but I, I want it to be white, white. You want it to be like... Hmm. Yeah. So if you spray paint it, will you still have those little bumps? Because all it looks like is just air bubbles. Yeah, it does look like air bubbles. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to coat it with this and then spray paint it. And then spray it. paint it? Yep. So, we'll see what happens. I'm all watching. Yeah, no, go ahead, because you're the star of the show now, because... Not, Mine's gonna take a little you're while. You're gonna take a while? Yeah. Okay. So I'm gonna continue on mine. It's not fully dry. I don't really care. Because if we sit here and wait for things to dry, you're just waiting. Yeah, where's we're here. The, all where's, the, time. where's the fun in that? So I have these little leaves, and I'm just gonna cut them, uh, cut the stems off. And we already have our glue gun hot. I have no idea how many leaves it's gonna take. I didn't try and count it out or measure it or anything like that. Okay. That's okay. Yeah. But I'm getting different um, colors and sizes just to have more of a variety. If you want only one kind of color, go for it. And they're small, so I don't think I need that many. Okay. Let's see if that's enough. Okay, I'm gonna wait for this little guy to dry and then I'm gonna go spray paint him because I'm not happy. 
I mean, it's okay, but it's not the best. Okay, so I just put some glue on on the leaf. Are you gonna Are you gonna color the top? Too? I was thinking about it, the little stem, but the the green isn't as vibrant. Like I'm looking at it in the video, mm -hmm. and it doesn't look bad. Okay. So I'm gonna leave it. All right. If I decide to, I can always change it. You can always paint it brown. Yeah. So. I'm just really throwing, cute. Oh, that's a lot. Cool. Oh. Don't hurt yourself. I didn't hurt myself. I just put a lot. I'm sorry. Do you need a spatula or something? What do you use a spatula for? She this isn't my know. mom's show. She wants to know <laughs> <laughs> what we use a spatula for. Because I burn myself all the time. Why? I, that's what I do. Oh. And Don't then... do that. <laughs> Little glue. There we go. Dot, dot, not a lot. Right. You remember that? No. Never learned that? Oh. Uh-uh. I guess they didn't have that. We back used to then. sit Indian style. Yeah, but you also use, you know, cursive wall mural, murals and. Oh. <laughs> but she's only 34, so that's not true. <laughs> that's true, I'm only 34. <laughs> okay, I'm putting more paint on here. See? Yeah, no, this is not working. I love this holder. Thanks. Were you here when I made it? I was. I wasn't See? here, but I was here. Oh. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna turn it. Look how cute that is. That's really cute. Super simple, like, except I'm getting paint everywhere because I was too impatient. <laughs> <laughs> you know what would be cute too is that metal sign that like, those says like, thankful harvest or, or thankful. Yeah. Yeah, because they bend, don't they? Aren't yeah, they, like, you can bend flexible? them. Flexible. They're hard to find though at the Dollar Tree now. So, like, if you find them, grab them because yeah, that's one of the reasons why we're gonna like finish all the ho the Halloween stuff now, is because they're almost out of Halloween stuff. Yeah. So you guys won't be able to find it anymore, and that's not fun. So we want to do things that you guys can find. I haven't burnt myself yet, though. That's very good. I know. Okay. I'm going to let you finish this up because I'm going to go spray paint this. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm almost done. I know. <laughs> That's why I have to be quick. Hurry, quick, fast like a bunny. But don't run because there's no fun in that. <laughs> I know. Uh, okay. Ah, I was one short. I have other leaves. I know. I tried to guesstimate and I got it wrong. But meh. It's not good. It's so funny. We have all these spray cans. We don't have orange. We don't have we don't have white, black, and blue. But that's okay. Make do with what you got. Oh my gosh, you guys, I love this. Look at how cute that is. Oh, it's still wet on the bottom because I kind of painted the bottom. But you could put it just, well, I got spider webs everywhere. I'm not the glue gun person. Jean always is. <laughs> but apparently she burned herself. But that's okay because I didn't. So I think we're kind of even right now. But that is super cute. Jean, you're going to love this. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm not the crafty person. I learned from her, <laughs> which is what's so fun working with her and like doing this with you guys because I see the stuff that you guys like post of her that you've made from the videos and it's really fun. Some of them have their own twists and all that kind of stuff and it's, it's just fun to see. I was telling Jean that like with her, her followers, she's hit like 55,000 and I'm like, that's so much. And it's become a community that, you know, you guys message or you know comment back and forth on each other i know some of you guys have met up with each other personally like in person and had your own little crafting date kind of thing and i just think that's awesome so 
yay you guys. I, th I think it's one of those things where everybody can do it, no matter what your skill level is. I can see her out there. She's trying to paint it really fast. <laughs> but thankfully it's not, you know, windy, because that would not be fun. Oh, she's coming. Jean, let me see. Did it work better? Yeah, it worked really good. Yeah? You still recording? Yes. Well, I can't reach. Turn it off. <laughs> I don't have a clicker clicker. Have you just been talking oh, to Oh, yeah. Them? You guys best friends now? Oh, yeah. Very right. nice. Yeah, look it. Oh, see? So, I'll tell you what. I would still paint it. That because way. it's not bubbling up at all. Uh-huh. So, that's pretty cool. So, you're done. I am done. Okay. Isn't that adorable? Yeah, really cute. I can barely see right now because of the being outside in the bright sun. <laughs> the pumpkin looks kind of green, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> it's because my don't, eyes aren't working really well. the paint. <laughs> oh, you're dripping. Have to be careful. I'm dripping? You're dripping. Oh. Oh, I see that. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to um, pause it and then we're going to come back after this dries. Okay. You guys, I've had the hardest time. I think there is something wrong with the pumpkin. This pumpkin. That pumpkin. Uh, we ended up painting two of them. That one's still drying, so I went back to the original one. And so I'm just going to stick with it. I'm going to now take some of the black. This is Mars black. And we're going to make a little Jack Skellington face. So we'll see. Are you going to use the brush for details? I'm going to use this little brush. Oh. So his face kind of is like, I don't know. I have no idea. So it's kind you of You all like, know what Jack Skellington looks like. Yeah, it's kind of like round, right? He's yeah. got round eyes. Like that? Kind of. Sure. Sure? Sure. Everyone has their own interpretation. His eyes are always different, though. Yeah. That's the thing. Like, you can tell by his mood, like, the way his eyes are. Well, yeah, he doesn't have eyebrows. <laughs> no, he doesn't. But I think they're kind of smaller up on top, and then, like, wider down at the bottom, right? Mm-hmm. I'm all just watching in the camera because I can't see. Oh. And then, it kind of looks right. And then he's got like these two little, like nostrils. nose things, yeah. Nose things? Yeah, nostrils. <laughs> right? But they're kind of rounded too, <laughs> I don't know. You can always... <laughs> if it was, I mean, you could call it an alien. But that's not an alien. He's going to look like Jack in just a minute. Okay, let me see. I think. Okay, show me. Okay. Okay, let me see. Then you're just going to swipe a smile. Swipe or no swiping? Swipe. See? And then he kind of like... Right? Uh -huh. But then he has, like, his mouth is kind of sewn on, right? Or is that Sally? Well, everything's sewn on Sally. Right. <laughs> so we're just going to put little marks like this. Oh my gosh, it's coming out so cute. She was so excited when she was explaining this craft to me. She thought, this is the I gotta do it. I... And she was like, no, it's not going to work real well. I'm like, I don't care. I'm going to do it. <laughs> okay. Okay. Does that look like Jack Skellington? It does. See? All right. I'm still waiting for you to take that stem thing out because I just want to see how that works. <laughs> We're not going to do that yet. Oh. I'm going to ask you to hold this, though. 
by passing it. <laughs> okay. Now, let's see. Okay. Now this guy. And then this guy. So I'm going to take this. And that has one of those, not, what are they called? Twist ties. Yeah, twist ties. On the back. So I'm going to twist it around and really have it hold on tight there. Like really tight. Because if you know Jack Skellington, he has a huge bow. I mean, this is really easy. This is a really, really easy craft. But I'm going to cut this off so you don't see it. And you can hot glue it down as well. But I left this little tree topper. And then, now's the part that you want to see. It's kind of dry, so you're just going to, like, pull it off, see? Huh. But, it didn't come all the way out. But that's okay. I am literally going to put some hot glue on here. Does hot glue melt the styrofoam? I don't know. Oh, I don't either. But I'll tell you what's going on, is I'm going to have to repaint this again because my Your fingers? fingers are stuck to it. That's because we're impatient. We went through that earlier. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> it's all smoking. I know. All right, there we go. Oh, I'm gonna push him down. Be careful with the bow. I know. It's really cute though. I think this is gonna be super cute and I might need to make this bow go a little bit. Lower. Lower. Look. I just have to paint his side because my finger took off some of the paint. Yeah, so if you guys wait for it to actually dry, like we're supposed to, you won't have the problem. Right? I'm just going to put some paint on there, cover it up a little bit. <laughs> Alright guys, it is really cute, seriously. I love my little idea, but um, yeah, wait for him to dry. So. Let's see yours. And then we painted an extra one, but we're gonna use that in a future DIY. But look at how cute that is. And then this one's mine. So these are our pumpkins for today. Super cute. Super easy. Very easy. Just be patient. And I love it. All right, beauties, please give me a thumbs up and give Denise another thumbs up. I know. No thumbs down. We've had a difficult time already as it is. <laughs> if you want to see more, make sure you subscribe. I promise they're not all this crazy and wacky and long. and oh, It's a tough <laughs> one, but I don't edit, so there you go. All right, beauties, have a wonderful day. Bye. I'll talk to you later. Bye. <laughs> one, two, three.